and welcome back to Street Fighter X Mega Man. Fight! <laughs> okay, and here we are again, episode 2. Watch me as little old Mega Man takes on the cream of the crop on the Street Fighter posse. Let's not beat about the bush. Who are we going to take on today? Who are we going to fight? Sea Viper. <laughs> sea Viper, also known as Crimson Fighter. Crimson Viper. Who has a penchant, penchant for auto turrets. Also known. Ah, oh, damn, got me. As the douchebags of bad guys. You just don't get that satisfying crunch of bone as you punch an auto turret in the face. And also, who, do, who has lifts that only work when you're not standing on them? Seriously, some you should call the janitor. Hey, ah, ah, well, ah. <laughs> Didn't want to change that screen. And who the heck are these red pack, red evil Pac-Man guys? Waka waka waka, you're dead, douche. Come on. Seriously, I just killed that guy. Okay. Now, for those people who don't know, although Crimson Viper just seems to be the nemesis of Chun Li in Street Fighter 4, where she first appears, she's got a fairly detailed backstory. Damn it! A <laughs> double life. Take that, Beatrice. Now, while working undercover for an American intelligence agency, the CIA, <laughs> she takes a job for Sin. Now, I've got no idea what Sin's for. Sin stands for. Uh, Seattle International Noses. Superman and Nappies. I've got no idea. <laughs> But Sin are testing out a super battle suit. Which looks like a regular suit with giant boobs stitched to the front. And under the cover of testing this suit, she enters... I was going to say the King of Iron Fist. She enters... The uh, Street Fighter 4. I... I am in big trouble here, because this lift is going one way. Damn you lift! I am not going to be killed by a lift. Whoa! I might be killed by a damn auto turret. Darn you! I cannot believe I was killed by an auto turret. Oh. Seriously. <laughs> as you can tell, I've had a little practice since the last time I played. So I'm not doing quite as badly against these auto things. But seriously. The most deadly things in this game are the lifts. Come on, up we go. Oh. Funny enough. That weird problem with the screen going up and down is almost an exact recreation of Mega Man from the snares. They've overlooked some no detail in getting everything just wrong with this game. Now the other thing I love with this game, and this also happened in classic Mega Man, is you can get infinite life. Effectively, as long as I keep going through this section with that life, I can carry on. I can carry on picking it up with no problem at all. Elevator, elevator, where have you been? Take me upstairs so I can fight queens. Oh. Now you might be thinking, why am I wasting my time coming up here? But if you look to the right here, elevator, 
I am basically going to be in a firing box if I don't take these guys out. I didn't really have to try and take them out by taking their laser beam with my face. But <laughs> you get the idea. Oh, the auto turret regenerated. So she can order she can she can afford a million auto turrets. But not a working lift. Or elevator for our American fans. Oh, Hey, I'm still one life up. I've been hit by one ball, one bean bag. Up we go. Come on, Batman, waka waka waka, douchebag. Ah, <laughs> another extra life. How many is that now? Four up and an energy can. And an energy can. Kabam. Oh, I can't believe he actually got me. Take that. Eat this. <laughs> Try this a different way. Let's see what happens. If I just try... Ah, oh, I think I've actually got more health than I had last time. Now that mouse is indestructible. You may remember it from such movies as Star Wars. Star Wars and Star Wars. Four, five and six. Running around the Death Star being an arsehole. Ah! Come on. Here we go. What the fuck? It's chasing me! Fuck, 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 No, let me go! Let me go! I want to live to see another day! What the? I was on the floor! on the ladder and everything! I can do this. I can do this. Okay, let's charge up. Drop down, ignore Pac-Man. Zoom! 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 Stupid mouse, dumb mouse, dumb mouse, get out of the way! Ah, I can't jump the right height! I hate you guys. <laughs> I'll get this. Now the biggest problem with this... Oh, how many lives have I got? Let's double check. Oh, two! Now what you guys might not understand is the hard bit of this is getting the jump height just right for those red skulls. Because you don't have digital, digital control. It's all down to nothing but timing. Seriously. Okay, let's do this. 
charge. <laughs> oh, I wish I was back. I wish I was back on Blanca's levels with the penis flowers. At least when I took one in the face from them, I wasn't due to a bloody jump. Oh yeah. Seriously, guys. You know what? Fight. Okay, through many trials and hardships, I've come back to you after the annoying speedrun level. You know what? I forgot I could do this. <laughs> let's head. Uh, let's head on. Damn you left, get me up there. Oh, I seriously thought there was nothing left after the speedrun. Let's go. Now all we have to do is get up to the top room and we're at the boss level. <laughs> no, I'm not taking Sin, S I N. Scorny Weaver in New Aliens maybe? <laughs> I apologize, guys. She floats. <laughs> I seriously cannot believe I just got wiped out that easily. Okay, nobody told me she had Cyclops powers. What? Okay. <laughs> I really wish I could go back to Melons. Okay guys, that's it. Well, hope you enjoyed your time watching Street Fighter X Mega Man and watch me next time as I take on another fighter. Bye bye.